me the dame of all trades and i'm here for another thrift haul that's right one week later thrift haul not a month not a year one measly week and i did it so i just want to say a couple things before we actually dive into the thrift haul itself just want to say thank you to all of the new subscribers there are so many different things that you can watch on youtube and i'm glad that you stopped by my channel and checked it out so I didn't want to leave you disappointed I wanted to get a thrift haul out as soon as possible the place that I got all of these items from is called at the present moment it's called Irving thrift they're actually owned by thrift giant which is one of my favorite uh, thrift stores I usually talk about them because I always go to the 50% off sale this was a 50% off sale about a month ago at Irving thrift but tomorrow they are opening at a new location and I think they're changing their name just to Thrift Giant so you kind of are familiar that they're all owned by the same company. They're just moving right across the street. Tomorrow's the grand opening and I plan on being there at 9 o'clock when they open the doors. And I have never been to, I've never even been to a store opening. Who knows? Thrift stores get crazy. You know, people mean business when they're going down. It's not even a joke. I'm hoping to wake up early tomorrow, get some coffee, go to the bathroom, and then see what craziness ensues once I get there. Most of these items I'm gonna be showing you today and most of the items I'm gonna actually be looking for tomorrow will all be for the Fine Shop, which is my online resale shop of uh, vintage items and pre-loved goodies that I just don't think should be passed up and should be shared. That's what I do. I thrift. I keep a lot of it for myself, but then the good stuff that either doesn't fit me or I already have enough of <clears throat> maxi skirts, I just, you know, sell to you guys at really affordable prices. I mean, I made the goal of keeping Thursdays as my thrifty Thursdays, but unfortunately this video will not be out until Saturday. So maybe Saturday's either becoming the new thrifty Saturday, say money saving Saturday. I have no idea. I am a rebel and I like to break the rules. So of course, any rule that I make, I obviously have to break since I'm a villain. That's not important at the moment. You all are safe. I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got. And if you wanna purchase any of these items from my shop, the URL is thefineshop.storeenvy.com and I'll put a link down here. You can check out the blog which will also be a link down there. You can subscribe up there or over there. It's it's one of okay you know where to go. If you've been on YouTube you know where to go and if not I'm pretty sure you are an intelligent human being and you can find it because you're awesome. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Let me show you a couple of things that I found and I'll let you know whatever's gonna be on the shop and then I'll let you know what I'm keeping, which is only a couple things, guys, a few things. Less than five things I'm keeping, so that's good. Okay, first things first. So the first, I found this actually in line because like I said, I, I went to a 50% off sale, so the line wrapped I went from the front of the building and then around the corner all the way in the back. So I had a lot of time to look at all this, my surroundings. Somebody must have picked this up and then decided that they didn't want it. But it's just this awesome scarf. And I just, look how huge this thing is. This thing is almost as big as me. Oh my goodness. I really just love how bright it is. I mean, you can't, get, can't doesn't get any better than that, really. I don't even know how to explain what this is, but I'll probably end up hanging this somewhere in the apartment. I think we've been here for about six months now and we're finally decorating. That's how long it takes us to do anything and that's how long it takes me to get into the mood of decorating. I mean I finally got my office put together. This is my office but you can't see the other side and the other side has like pictures and stuff and this definitely needs to be decorated. I just haven't gotten around to it. One day it'll be one of those things will be like two or three o'clock in the morning and I'm like I need to decorate. And it'll probably be like whenever I start a new job and I have to be there super early the next morning. I look forward to that. Really awesome scarf. I'm keeping this one and probably gonna use it for decoration. Since we're kind of in the accessories category, I'm gonna go ahead and show you some shoes. Oh yeah. So the first pair of shoes that I wanna show you are these really awesome Brighton loafers. Now I originally bought these for myself because it said it was a size six and a half, but unfortunately they do not fit. So what's not mine is yours for a price. I'd give it to you for free, but 
girls gotta eat and girls gotta support her habit of thrifting you know what I mean this is a great and durable brand so you know that these are definitely gonna last um, what I really like about it is it's kind of cut open on the sides and then it has this nice little detail on the front and then this little rope so it's almost I like their stuff because it reminds me, I know it kind of reminds me of like the older ladies in Texas who wear like the belts with all the jewels and stuff, but there is some stuff that I really like and I've been liking a lot of uh, more Southwestern inspired pieces. So anything with these little, um, I don't know what to call them, these metal embellishment things, uh, I just really like it. Anything that's like laced on the front or ropes. Anything like that, I'm really digging lately. Another pair of shoes that I found, which these are awesome because, okay, they are Payless brand, but that doesn't matter. You know, when you were a kid, you wore Payless shoes, right? I know I did, and they lasted a while. But uh, these are, okay, they are incredibly dusty, so I, I apologize in advance. But these are new with tags still on them. So back in the day, whenever these were purchased, uh, they were $14.99. But they're just these really adorable chunky sandals so I will have these on the shop available to you so if you wear a size seven and a half you really need to get these and wear them while summer is happening because they are awesome and if I could keep them I would but I can't so please check them out no I have a I have a few thrifted shoes but I never have to look like some of you guys whenever I see your videos and you're like yeah I thrifted these awesome boots and I'm like when can I find a pair of awesome boots? I found one pair of great boots and I have worn them to death, basically. But I'm always on a lookout and just frustrating, man. When is it my turn? Those shoes will be on the shop. Why should the fine shop just be for the ladies? It should be for you guys. It should be for anybody. Everybody go to the fine shop now and buy things. Another thing that's going to be in the shop is this really awesome Western inspired button up. Now I think that the pattern is really great and if it was a little bit smaller I probably would end up keeping it for myself but I think that this is, the tag says that it's a size small but I don't know I mean I think that a guy, a, if you are a guy and you wear a size small and you want to get this shirt go for it and if you're a lady this is an awesome shirt just to throw on over a cut off tee and then some cut off shorts and stuff just throw this on over that and then you're good to go. I just really like cover-ups and I like being covered up and everything so I'm really into layering even during the summer as long as it's something that's loose and flowy fabric like this. If you're a dude and you wear size small go ahead and snag this up. If you're a girl and this is awesome to you like it's awesome to me go ahead and you can get it. I apologize in advance I should iron these clothing or maybe not keep them in a pile for a month before I actually do a thrift haul but uh, I originally was thinking about getting this giving this to my mom because Whenever I go shopping, I kind of have an eye. Um, I try to look out for things that my sisters could use and then also things that my mom could take advantage of. So what this is, is it's an express dress and the size is five or five six. And all it is, is it's this really nice mint green wraparound dress. Let's see, and I think I tied it right. I tried my best, but I don't know if I'm really good at these kind of things but I think it's just a really adorable color and I might be too light but if I get tanned and wear this it might be a little bit big but I think that this would be cute for anyone so if I decide not to uh, send this to my mom I'm gonna go ahead and put this online so I'll iron it of course so you can see what it actually looks like cause this is super cute it just won't fit me but I like it I really like it this is something I am keeping and this this is the stuff that I live for, finding stuff like this. So like I said, I like things that kind of cover you up and if it's long and oversized and dramatic, I've been really into that kind of thing. So I'm gonna just throw this on. So I guess somebody handmade this, but I mean, this goes, look how long it is. It goes all the way down. And this will be fun to do like photo shoots in or even like if I just wanna wear a bathing suit and then walk over to the pool, just throw this on and I'm ready maybe a floppy hat or something but yeah I'm keeping this this is not leaving me anytime soon I definitely look forward to wearing this sometime and I know I'll probably get some looks but most of the things that I wear I get looks just because I feel like I have been having to wear a uniform for work so if I'm not at work I'm gonna dress up in whatever I want and if I want to dress like a crazy person or if I want to dress like I'm in an 80s southwestern movie about things that 
they made 80s movies about like you know like a romantic comedy or something that's how i'm gonna dress that's been my hugest inspiration really though like 80s western movies i just well they're not like 80s western movies just 80s movies that took place in like the desert if that makes any sense that's just what I like. I think I'm keeping this, but I haven't tried it on, so I don't know if it fits. This is just like a random thing that I found just because I saw the color and I thought it was really nice. And I like this little ruffle um, in the front because it gives you like a nice detail without being a print. So this can be thrown under a blazer and it can be like dressed up for work or you can even wear it with a pair of shorts. And it's something for summer, you know? And I like versatile pieces like this and especially in color because as you all know, and as I'm wearing right now, I like to wear black pretty much I mean, there's a shirt under here and it's like a floral crop top. And of course, I can't just wear it by itself. I had to put sheer black lace over it. But it's a floral and there's like white and blue and yellow and colors. I'm wearing colors. So this is just like a Miley Cyrus top. I think it's a size small. You know, it doesn't even have a tag. But yeah, I'm going to keep this. I'm going to try it on. If it doesn't fit, then it'll be on the shop. Simple, adjustable strap. Xbox. Stop. I have uh, Orange is the New Black on pause because I need to get this thrift haul recorded before tonight so I can edit it for you tomorrow. And uh, since I have the connect, it kind of will like listen to words and think that I say play or stop. But I didn't say any of those words and it's a little startling sometimes when you're just kind of here by yourself and then all of a sudden it plays. Kind of spooky. Let's keep moving on. Since it's summer and it's going to be hot, uh, I decided to pick up a bunch of shorts that some of them are gonna I'm gonna distress. Some of them are just gonna go straight on the uh, on the fine shop. So a pair of and high waisted Levi's and these are already cuffed and sewed. So you, I'm not gonna cut these or do anything. So these are these would be a really nice pair of shorts for the summer. The size on this is size seven. If you're a size seven and you want a pair of Levi's go check them out on the shop in the shop whatever another pair of shorts that I got and this brand is called Dos Extremos just some high-waisted these are kind of short I haven't tried these on or anything but I think that they're a really nice color and those are going to be short I have to try these on I think that the color is just really nice and it's nice not to have to wear just regular blue jeans or black denim or anything if you can add some color to your to your life spice up your life these will actually be on the fine shop so um, if these don't fit me, I'll find someone else and then we'll kind of see how it fits so you know how short they are before purchasing. Now this one is for me. Now this is, uh, it's from Target and it's a size small and it kind of is just this really oversized tunic kind of thing. And what I like about this is I could just throw this on and then put on a pair of tights and then maybe some frilly boots or something and then I'm ready to go wherever I'm going. I'm ready to go to the places. And I've been trying to wear this out but I keep telling myself don't wear it. Wait, do the thrift haul. So now that I've done the thrift haul I can wear this. So maybe I will wear this tomorrow when I'm thrifting because I'm gonna need some air if it's hot and I like to be covered up because I mean business. Loose, comfortable clothing when you go thrifting. I just have a couple pairs of shorts that I'm going to be putting online. So these, I need to actually, I probably will just keep these the way they are. As you can see, I cuffed one side of them just so you can see what it looks like. Any kind of pattern or stripes or anything, I don't like to distress them because I think I like the way that they look uh, nice and pristine like this. This is a pair of Lee denim. Just a nice light denim with white stripes. So yeah, this is just another pair of shorts that I'm going to add to the fine shop for you. The size on these guys are size 5. I will measure them and distress them and put them online for you. So if you want to purchase those, they'll be there for you. And I did it. I did another thrift haul in a week. I recorded the whole thing. And I actually have to go to the bathroom right now. And if you know me, I always have to go to the bathroom, so I'm just going to make this super quick. And I might talk fast, but I will enunciate so you understand the words that come out of my mouth. Um, okay, so expect another thrift haul coming soon, because tomorrow I'm going thrifting again. So that means new items for the fine shop, the fine shop .com. The link will be down below. Check out my blog, thedameofoddtrades.blogspot.com, and if you haven't already, do yourself a favor. <laughs>